Greetings and salutations. I am JW608, and this is Star Maid, and we are on the testing ship Bad Idea. And let me show you what's going on here. It's more or less a bunch of power stuff with some hull and some advanced armor on the bottom, because I'm not testing uh, the bottom, and 12 anti-missile turrets, our new com super compact models. And that's basically it. I'm going to summon in a bunch of uh, Isans and see how long it takes to kill me. Let's see. So we're going to mass spawn in some ships. We're going to add da -da -da, type M. I want type M, M, M. Faction, negative one. Amount, five. Except I don't want to be that close to them. I'm going to warp over one sector. Where are they? Alright. Now this ship has no shielding because you aren't going to have, in the real world, you aren't going to spawn a right on top of a pirate. Well, unless you're really unlucky. Anyway, this ship has no shielding. None whatsoever. So the only protection it has, other than the advanced hull, are these uh, turrets. Why am I shooting myself? Why is it doing damage? Uh, everything's faction the same. Oh, that's odd. Uh, anyway, uh, so any defense I have is going to come from these turrets. No shielding, nothing like that. I don't even have thrusters. I can't maneuver. I'm just a sitting duck. And... Zinsanth are incoming. So if these turrets can't take out a missile, it does that. It does damage to them. Alright, so this was going to be the stress test. Another hit, another hit. Now keep in mind there are five Isan Swarmers, or uh, miss the Swarmer missiles. Hmm, almost looks like they're all targeting on the same, same missile. Hmm. Be nice if they could, uh... Nice to say, oh, that's a greater threat than the other guy. Huh. I already have one overheating. And I think that's been more from me shooting my own self than from the, the missile attacking. I think they're taking down quite a few. That there go two, but quite a few are getting through. Again, this is probably uh, beyond what most ships would face. I don't think I've ever seen five Isanth, uh swarmer swarmers attack. Uh, is everybody over that way? Tell you what, we're gonna rotate. There we go. So it's going to take a little skill to, to, to rotate your ship to uh, to face the oncoming missiles, unless you have these guys all over the place. So I've already lost two. You look like you've become inoperable. Yeah. Lost everything. Lost the uh, cannon computer, so it's useless now. Well, once I oriented it, it looks like it's doing better. Not shooting itself, not letting as many through. There's another shot, fresh shot from the Swarmers. Are they fighting anything in particular? No. Also looks like the Swarmers are going after the other Isants. Oh, here's one incoming. Are you going to get it? No. Oh, no, no, that's zero, zero. I was thinking it was 0 0.5, so I'm not actually doing damage to myself. Hmm. Looks like these things can get overwhelmed, and they also look like they like to shoot into themselves. So let's keep an eye on that. Ooh. Got a hit back here. 
And another incoming. Got it. Haha. <laughs> Why I don't have explosion sounds? I have the sound on this. It's always given me kind of problems. And impact. Impact. Was that an impact? No, it wasn't an impact. I actually got it. Alright, this is a whole bunch of insanity. Uh. They got that one. No impact. That one looked like, yeah, that one looked like it was a hit. Because this turret's out of commission now. Took out the Bobby, no, it didn't take out the Bobby A5. What's going on? Took out its, um, its main cannon. That, so I have two, four out of commission. One having a hard time. Okay. They aren't doing too bad. I've not had any missiles penetrate the hull. So let's see. Uh, this ant, just a regular type M. Faction, negative one. I'm gonna throw in two of them. And I hit escape, so that didn't actually bring them in, did it? No. I spawn ships, add this ant. Zero type M, faction negative one is pirates. Mount, let's grab two, okay. And two very close direct hits are not good. All right. We're gonna spin around. All right. There, they should be able to get that. They didn't. So it looks like if you get real close, you're gonna have a. You're not. Or if you let the enemy get real close, these turrets aren't gonna do be doing much for you. But if you can keep your distance, uh, it looks like they'll keep you safe from swarmers and things of that nature. But even so, I still have quite a few that are still alive. And I've only actually had one hull breach, and that was from a point-blank blast. Hmm. You look like you're having some problems, but you're still trying to fire. And it's shooting itself. This is more a stress test for my computer than it is for the turrets. Oh, the missiles. Alright, so we found some weak points and some strong points. Weak points, um, anything real close, they aren't going to have time to, uh, to uh, they're not going to have time to react. Uh, anything on the other side of the ship, they're not going to have time to react. Are not going to have physical ability to react, so keep an eye out on your turrets. Make sure they aren't shooting yourself. Try to turn the turrets toward the, the missiles. Give them a little hand. Um, they're somewhat frail. Now, if I had shields, this would be a different story. They're somewhat frail, but uh, overall, not bad. They've gone, oh, what has been. How long have I been recording? Where you will be us nine minutes, so I probably jabbered for two minutes. So it's held the 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 ship or these twelve turrets have held their own for quite some time against five, then seven Isans. It looks like the swarmers aren't doing an awful lot to start out with, and now we can really tell the effectiveness of all twelve turrets as as the others are starting to. To die, you're getting more damage through. So you can tell that uh, beforehand they were real effective because not this many missiles were hitting me. And I may not have seen it as effectiveness at the time. It spins, you don't have to hit the corpse of your friend there. Hmm. 
uh, weak points, well, the weak points of all turrets are the rail, where the rail attaches, you hit that, then they're not a turret anymore, it's a gun floating in space. Uh, being up close, any point-blank hits, they don't have time to react. Um, pros, these things are fairly cheap, they're effective at range, so if I was going to go uh, cost a pirate station or somebody I know who loves swarmers, they get a bunch of these out and keep them a sector or so away, I'll, I'm fine. Actually, I don't know about the range for the cannon cannon. I don't think it's that far. And it looks like I have finally lost all cannons 10 minutes and 48 seconds into the recording. So, it's held its own fairly well. I, I'm impressed by these little, these little anti, I want to call them anti-matter, anti-missile turrets. In fact, I might be throwing a few on the, uh, on the freighter just, just because. And they're real small, not a lot of space they use up. Uh, they don't have the long barrels, so they don't hit things when they move around. I've had that problem before. Uh, I'm fairly impressed with the design. I imagine somebody can make it better, and they will. And if you do make it better, uh, send me a message, a link, something. I wanna, I wanna see it. Take a video of it. Or link to the blueprint, whatever. Because I'd like to see, see your take. If you can build a 3x3x5 three by three by with a 3x3 three three width and depth 5 high turret, or smaller, that's more effective than this, I'd love to see it. I'm not real good with turrets, so this has been an adventure of learning learning process, if nothing else. Hopefully you all have found it useful. And, as the last bits of my ship are blown to kingdom come, I am JW608, this is Star Maid, and I will dig you cats later. Preferably from a uh, more missile-free zone. Have fun.